YouTube. So today I'm going to do a tutorial on one hairstyle that I've been doing heaps. Um, this is for back to school since school starts back here in Australia. Uh, it starts back on Wednesday, Thursday I think. Um, so yeah, this is one style I've been doing heaps in the last couple of days. Um, it's basically just an off-centered part and then you're doing, you can do different braids going back into messy buns. As you guys probably already know, I love messy buns. So make sure you send me in the photos but let's get straight into it. Now for the parting you can use like a tail comb but I'm just using my fingers so the middle part would be straight down there wouldn't it be? but I really don't like that on my hair so I'm going to go a bit this way and then a bit that way and just pull it so it's kind of in the middle but it's really messy um, so I curled my hair today so it's a bit textured <laughs> so that is better for holding um, so it's better if um, your hair is a day or two old if you're doing this so what we're going to do, we're first going to do a French braid. It's going to split it into three sections. Outside goes to the middle. Outside to the middle. It's up here. It's something on me. Outside to the middle. Outside to the middle. Pick up. I'm just going to go all the way down. As far as you want. And so you're just gonna do it to the end. Now you can tie this off an elastic, but I'm not going to. So let me get a hair tie. Now I'm gonna do a messy bun. So I'm gonna bring it to the back here. That. Make sure there's nice, it's nice and how you want it. Alright, so back to here. I love about having my hair curled is that it sits much nicer in my seat bones. So then I'm going to pull out the front bits. You can make it a bit looser. And so, that is the hairstyle. So with this um, hairstyle you can actually do so many different braids. You can do French, Dutch, fishtail, twists, you can do heaps of braids. Um, so yeah, just keep playing along with different braids um, and just find what suits you the best. Um, what you can also do with the first braid, I just did the French one, I only did it on this side, but you can do it going around the other side as well, or both sides if you want. It's really up to you. So just play with it until it's how you like it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and make sure you send me in your recreations of this style um, to my Instagram, classy underscore braids. And I have a few photos of um, what I've done with that style as well and if you want to check those out. Um, so thanks for watching. Make sure you give this a big thumbs up. If you have any other braids or styles you want me to try, make sure you write them in the comments below and I'll see you guys around.